everybody, welcome back to my channel. My name is Lauren and today I have a Stitch Fix to unbox. So I am excited to get the Stitch Fix. I'm hoping that it will be a little better than my last one. Um, those of you that don't know what Stitch Fix is, it's a uh, styling subscription service where you pay a $20 styling fee. They send a box of five items to your house, try them on. If you keep all five, you get a 25% discount. Your styling fee gets applied to that. So it's pretty simple. If they don't like, you can send them back. So when we open up our box, we have our prepaid mail. Don't love it or like it, send it back. And it looks like we have our note and our pricing sheet. We'll look at that in a second. And already I'm seeing some colors and it is filling out of the box already. So, so purple, so blues and greens, some cream colors. Now, if you remember from my last video, I felt like I was completely ignored. So with my note that I left, cause I really wanted a um, all dress fix and, or like a romper, like dresses or rompers. And I got jeans and tops. There was one, like a jumpsuit that was horrendous, but it wasn't an actual romper. So this is my 16th fix. So put that pricing sheet on the side. Let's read our note. So this, so my stylist is Sue, which that's a new stylist for me, have not had Sue. She says, hi Lauren, happy fix day. I hope you're doing well. My name is Sue and I am excited to be your partner in, in style today. I'm sorry about your last experience. Today I did my best to include as many dresses as I could with your specific style preferences and requests. Let's start things off with this pretty 41 Hawthorne wrap knit dress that will be perfect to wear during the day on the beach or over your swimsuits. Uh, style it with your favorite sandals, a cute tote, and a wide brim hat along with a pair of stylish sunglasses to complete the look. The navy magnolia grace knit dress is a great option for an evening stroll, dinner date, or just drinks and dancing the night away. Pair it with your favorite heels, statement accessories, and a clutch for a stunning look. I had so much fun styling you today. I uh, hope you enjoy everything XO soup. So in my note, I was very specific this time. So I told her, I'm like, look, I want an all dress fix. This is my birthday month. We have a trip planned. We're gonna be going um, to try to escape some of the smoke and everything here that's settling into the valley uh, in California. As everybody knows, we're on fire. So I'm hoping that getting away to one of the up north beach communities that it won't be as crazy and as smoky. So that was what I told my husband for my birthday. I wanted to get out of town. So that was pretty much what I told her in my note. Like I want dresses for this reason. And here's like the style card, give some tips. So let's crack into this. It does look, when I look, whoops. So it does look, when I look at the style card, there is one top and a maxi skirt. So I'm assuming she means for those two things, even though she didn't mention it in her note, that she means for those two things to be um, worn together. So this first maxi skirt is by Gilly. It's the Delina knit maxi skirt in purple. Let's get a little closer. You can see the print. That's kind of pretty. It's one of those ones where you have to try it on. I don't, I don't know how I feel about this one yet. Definitely a long maxi skirt. Next up, this must be the Magnolia Grace dress. Yes. So let's see. So Magnolia Grace, the Larson embroidered knit dress in navy. Tuck the tags in. Second, if I can get this untwisted. So this one has kind of this front twist design. It has a couple little cutouts here and then the um, embroidered little collar. It's this navy kind of a floral, 
all the way down and then the back is just the print. So we'll try that one on. Now this one, let's see here. This is the 41 Hawthorne dress she talked about. This one is the Lena Faux Wrap Knit dress in off-white. Oh, this is pretty. So it's kind of got this more muted uh, floral pattern. It's got the little belt, the faux, it's the faux wrap. And it's, um, definitely like a stretchier material. Let's see. So it's 40% polyester, 46% rayon, and 6% spandex. So we'll try that on. That's, that's cute. So here's the top by Democracy. And this is the one I'm assuming pair with the skirt. It says the, by Democracy, the, uh, Anya embroidered tank top. So this one, or these other little tags, does the same thing. So it's got the little, oh, kind of like a little cap sleeve, little flutter going on. You can see the embroidered detail comes across in the front and then it has the line that goes down. It is uh, an elastic waist bottom and the embroidery area looks kind of sheer through the front so we'll try it on we'll try it on and then last is a black dress by gold ray the blaze ribbed knit dress in solid black never heard of gold ray before so this one is definitely a little thicker material it's, it, compared to some of the other. This is definitely a nice heavy weight. Um, it's got the faux wrap. It's kind of got a little bit of a, I want to say three quarter sleeve because that's probably going to stop like right about here on me all the way down. Let's see. So yeah, it goes down the side and it has like a little gather, but it's stitched all the way down. So we'll try that on. All right, so that's everything that I got in my box. I'm happy that she listened and sent me some dresses to try on. So let's get to it. Okay, so I have on the ghillie skirt and the democracy top. And I'm not really sure how I feel about this. The top I think is really cute. I wasn't too sure how I would like the elastic waist bottom but it's actually really loose and it fits nicely the skirt I think this combines really well I mean I put on my my hot pink sandals I don't I don't really know now after I put them on if yeah I probably would I would wear those I just don't know I don't know if this is just too much for me I'll move a little closer so you can see the two combined, I think is really cute. I just don't know how I feel about the skirt. When I lift the shirt up, it definitely hugs this pooch, but it's also really kind of loose. So I almost feel like this band up here, it's almost like I can, roll, I feel like I can roll it down. And, but then even this is still really loose on me this way and I don't know I think it's cute I just don't know how much wear I would get out of this and again the only person I have to ask at the moment was my 13 year old son who was like yes to the shirt no to the skirt he told me that I looked too he was too young for me is what he said so I don't know, it, it's already a little too big. I would need a downsize, but I do I do like the top. I think the top is really cute. I like the little sleeves. I think paired with a pair of skinny jeans, this would be really cute. Or even the black maxi skirt that I got in um, my Every haul, I think that this top would look really cute with that. So I'm kind of, also because I do have the other one, I don't know if I need to, now if this, now that I'm looking at it, 
in the camera view, if it was more of like a maxi, or, or not maxi, but like a midi skirt, if it was more like that, I think that would be better. Like just, it would be a little bit, I don't know. I think all the way down, I wish this was just more of a midi. I think that would be cuter. Okay, so I've got three more dresses to try on, so let's let's get a move on. Okay, so I have on, hello, Eleanor. This is Ellie, so she's gonna help do a little try on. This is the Magnolia Grace dress. I'm gonna be honest, this is not, I don't really like this. I feel like it's too short on me. It's up too high. I'm saying, bless you. So it comes up too high. I think if I was to raise up, it even comes up higher. I don't like that. It hugs too much this way. I think the colors, step around you. I think the colors are pretty, but it needs to be, for me and my comfortability, it needs to just come down a little bit longer. Now let's talk about the front here. So this, I don't really like it. It's just not me. I don't really like this cutout and this twist. I feel like if this embroider, embroidery was just like a scoop, I think that would have been better or just not at all. Like had this material be the scoop or all the way, I don't know. Like it just, I, I don't like this part. This dress is definitely not, not for me. So, okay, we've got two more, so let's move on. Okay, so now I have on the 41 Hawthorne uh, faux wrap dress and I am actually really liking this one. I like the way it sits on me. I love the way it kind of, what would you call that? Like the tulip kind of a look how it comes up here and then goes down. You can see it's longer in the back. Now the faux wrap part of it, I'll move a little closer. It is uh, fully stitched right here on the side. So if there was a wind, it's not gonna be a problem. The V-neck up front, there is no like snap or anything, but I think the way the material is I don't feel like it's gonna move around and I've been putting on some various jackets and things. Um, but I like this because I think this has some versatile qualities to it. I think I could pair this with a jean jacket and I'm gonna have on, again, I just put my hot pink wedges that I got from my uh, loft haul on. I thought those looked kind of cute, but I was in my closet and I have this maroon jacket that I got from a Wantable box. And I thought that if I paired the two together, that this would be a nice, you know, a blazer to add to this that would make this appropriate for work. And I thought that the colors that kind of blend off of each other, I don't know, what do you guys think? I don't know about the hot pink shoes with the maroon. I might have to change that up, but would you wear this to work? Would this be okay for an office setting? What do you guys think about that? I may know we're going into fall and white's kind of on its way out, but I thought this was super cute. And I mean, you could, wear it casually. I could even put on a pair of, you know, more casual flip floppy, not flip flops, but just casual sandals or heels and dress it up. Turn. So what do you guys think about this one? So far, this is probably my favorite item out of the whole box. Okay, so now I have on the gold gray uh, rib knit dress. And this one I do like, it's super soft. Like the material is very, very soft. It is a faux wrap. It is attached over here at the edge. Um, I think this point, the way it comes down in the front is very flattering. I like that part a lot. My issue with this dress is that I almost feel like it's too big. I have a lot of um, extra room that the elastic that hits here 
I mean, it can really pull out and it moves around a lot. And so I feel like it's, I feel like it's almost, too, it hugs just enough, but it's almost too loose because when I go up with my arms, then it gets caught on my ribs. So then I'm constantly then shimmying this part back down. So it's like if you're reaching for something or, you know, passing the stall at the table, I don't know. I like it, but I just think that it's a little too, somebody's bringing me her toy again. She's got her Frisbee. I don't know. It just, it's a little too loose and not, because I, it's not as fitting. I think that this is supposed to be a little more form fitting. It is definitely shorter than what I'm used to. Um, I like how the point comes down and where it hits. I think if it was just a little, little, just if I'm, I'm pulling it down, but if it was just a little bit longer like that, so then in the back, it hits more at the base of my, my knees in the back, like there, versus like above my knees where it would hit. And it's just the fact that I'm constantly kind of tugging on it is what my issue is. But otherwise, I do think this is a great dress. I think it's very flattering. The sleeve lengths I like, it's thick and it's warm. Move a little closer to the V-neck right through here. It's open. There's no modesty snap or anything like that. But I don't know, what do you guys think? I mean, am I, am I too far out of the box to think that when you raise your arms that your dress shouldn't hike up and it should stay where it needs to stay? Because that, I think, is just going to drive me nuts. All right, so let me get out of this and then we'll do a quick little wrap up. So I thought I'd show you guys a little bit about what I deal with every day. Somebody likes to crawl up in my lap with her toys and just hang out. So she thinks that she's still a puppy and that she's a little itty bitty lap dog and she gets up in my lap so she can stare out the window and this is what we do. So again, this is little Ellie. Can you please get down now? Can you, we'll play Frisbee when we're done. Okay. I got to do a wrap up for, for everybody. Okay. Come on. Let's go. Oh. <laughs> That's my life. All right, so let's do this. So we'll make it quick so I can go play Frisbee with someone who's still right here. So first up, let's start off with the democracy top. I thought this was super cute. I was, you know, uh, surprised that I liked it as well as I did. The nice little cute detail. This democracy, again, it's the uh, Anaya embroidered tank top. It says a tank top, but that's, it's got sleeves. It's not a tank top. Uh, it's $58. So I don't know. I have to think about it. We'll see. Then we have the black faux wrap dress by um, Gold Ray. This one, I kind of feel like it's too big. It's an extra large, but I don't know. I'm, I, I, I want it to fit. I want it to fit so badly. Like I like it. I like it a lot. And I think it's super soft and it's just, it's got some great things about it that I really do like. It's just the way it rides up. I don't like that. Um, this is $68. And because of that riding up, I'm, I don't know, even if I size down, is it still going to ride up? Is that still going to probably be a problem? Or if I size down, would it fit the way it's supposed to? So I don't know. So I'm probably going to pass just because I don't know the answer to that. Now, next up, this I do like. I like this one a lot. This is the 41 Hawthorne. It's this pretty floral print. I think that it has some good qualities that you can, or some good versatility is really what I'm looking at. So this, again, is the Leanna Faux Wrap Knit Dress, and it's $68. So this one in my mini pile. Then we have the um, maxi skirt. This one again, let's see. 
it says Gilly on here, but hold on. Yeah, it says Gilly. This is Gilly. But on my sheet, it says Lay Lee. Like sometimes I don't get white stitch fix. Like it says Lay Lee, maxi skirt, purple, everything else that it says on the tag, except for it's got the brand name wrong. So this, this is $48. It's pretty, it's too big, which I'm shocked to say that. I mean, I have been trying to exercise and eat right. And it's just this part, this waist part around here. I, even when I rolled it down, I still felt like it was just too loose around the top, which is a good thing, but I think I'm going to pass on this one. I don't know. I just think that I have another maxi skirt. I don't know if I need to. I definitely think it's really pretty. I love the, I do like the pattern that's on there. And like I said earlier, if it was a midi skirt, I think I would definitely get, it. I would size down and I would get it. Um, just cause it's the full length maxi. I'm kind of like, mm, I don't know. And then last we have the Magnolia Grace. This is the embroidered knit top. This was the most expensive item. This one is 74. I just didn't like it. I like, I like this print. I think this print is really pretty. I like this. I just don't like the top. I don't like this knot part right here. I don't like the little cutouts. It's just not, it's not me. It's not my style. Um, and it was too short. Like it doesn't, it, I need that. I'm tall. I like my stuff to come down a little bit longer, which sometimes is a challenge when it comes to dresses. So all in all for the total for everything was $316. The buy all five discount of 25% would make it $79. So the subtotal is $237. And I do have a little bit of credit because when I bought some stuff off Shop Your Looks and then I returned it. So I have a $35 credit on there. Uh, so my, my order total would be $201.78. So I know I'm not gonna keep everything um, definitely these two are going back. The black dress is going to go back. Um, it's for me, it's between these two. I surprisingly just really like this top. And then the dress I think would have some good wear in it. I'm going to try it on again. I'm going to think about it overnight. Um, but I do think that come next spring, Spring, I could pair it with a blazer and wear it to work. Now, if I'm wrong with that and you guys didn't think that looked right, please, please, please let me know. Um, I'd love to hear all your feedback in the comments below. And again, please like and subscribe. Always appreciate that. And thanks again for spending a little bit of your time with me today. And until next time, stay safe and healthy and I'll see you later. Bye.